what's going on y'all so one of my team corrali morocco xtr so basically it's a coronos xtr um i just put the morocco body on there um and, and then tires and wheels it's a little bit wider or it sets wider than your standard morocco because i do have the wider steering blocks on there so um so that's it. I mean, people have asked me about it before. No, they don't have one. Maybe they'll make one at some point in time. I do. New. But, um... I love the way this looks. I may actually take this back and put the original steering blocks in here. Or the heavy-duty ones that are not so wide. I want to see how it handles like that. But I kind of like it like this, too, so... this back over here there we go <laughs> I thought I was gonna be able to land that all right we're back tires are a little worn down I think my steering is off a tad let me get this come back to me let's see no Definitely need to get a faster servo one. I do have the stock team Corrali servo one. I do have it turned up from uh, the six volts to 7.4. So the fan is kind of charming in there too, but. Gotta love the way this thing looks though. Wow. <laughs> One thing about a truggy is if it flips, what I try to do is I try to hit the throttle a little bit, not too much, so that the wheels will at least touch on the ground so that it can kind of flip over. But obviously, uh, that hasn't worked two times in a row. So I need to just uh, let it flip and see if it'll come back on its feet. Now my tires are pretty worn down on here, you guys can see. I'm not getting too much traction out here, but it's fine. For me, it's enough for doing what we're doing out here. Ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. had to try to save that. You gotta love today, days like today. It's not too hot, it's not too cold, the sun's not beating down on you, it's a cool breeze every now and then. And you got several cars you really like to run out. <laughs> to me, you can't beat that. Very joyful day. Take some mile jumps.
<laughs> jump into my car <laughs> and then down into the car a lot do see my connector kind of hanging out here on the side definitely want to i don't know why i haven't taken that off yet and just made it to where it just runs one light bulb which i have to do I don't think that is a news helicopter. If you guys can see that right there. <laughs> Maybe. Run right into the curve. I'm so glad they got these upgraded heavy duty steering blocks on. It's not even funny. No more popping out. Oh my gosh. It's like a relief. <laughs> Cause now I can do jumps like that and run it. I don't have to worry about that. That's kind of why I need that faster servo in here. Oh, and I added the Willy Bar to here in case you guys don't know, didn't notice. See how smooth that is? I think uh, I lost some steering. Let's see. I don't know if it came loose or not. Oh, I did. Uh, I think I lost that screw over there. Let's see real quick. Oh, that actually broke off. So that's gonna end this run for this one. Um, not too bad, I mean, considering landing like that and stuff, but uh, that's, I guess if there's one weak point I have seen on these Corrali cars, is gonna be the turnbuckles. You guys know on my uh, Kronos, I did break the rear one but i did have a 30 40 foot jump with that one and then this one just broke here so i'm gonna look at replacing that i may look at getting because actually i think it's just the plastic that broke yeah just the plastic broke off on that one so that's not too bad so anyway guys i'm gonna end this video get that replaced and get this back out and get it back running these tires are gone that's why it was kind of when i was turning and stuff it was sliding around because these tires are pretty much gone uh, but i have to get another set at some point in time but that's going to be a run of this Listen to this guy making all this noise back here. That he just got to third gear, y'all. <laughs> so anyway, don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos. Thanks for watching.